Homecoming, Presbyterian College. Hacksaw Butch Harris, School of Hard Knocks. This is my diploma. Laura Poole, Georgia Southern University. I'm Coach McDuffie, a.k.a. Dr. McDuffie. And we're taking you to the clinic. Jason Pinkney, Lehigh University. Cornbread Pudding, friends call me Pudding, straight out of the woods of Klondike. Jennifer Dykes, GCSU, home of the Bobcats. Tisa Newsom from Baldwin County University. Mr. Hanson, I'm coming for you. I say it's all right. Hi, I am Danielle Childs, and I'm here with Coach Petrie. Hi, Coach Petrie. How are you doing? Good. How do you feel about the faculty basketball game? Aren't you going to be coaching the Savages? What do you mean, how do I feel? Do you think your team's going to do good? Do good? I'm not worried about that. The only thing I'm worried about is looking good when I'm out there. Thinking about my team. The only thing I'm wondering is how I got a guy that's like four foot eleven put on my team. I'm guessing nobody else in the school wanted him. So just put him on my team. At least I have somebody to talk to on the bench as we're destroying them. All right, well, you, you, there you have it, Wolves. If we move the ball here, you go set a screen away. I'll come around and shoot the three. Hey, guys, what, no, shoes, what three. shoes should I wear? What shoes? Hey, look, I got all this. Which one? The silver, the black, or the, hey, these are cool right here. We got a lot of stuff on. For real, hey. we got to. It's a basketball game, man. Basketball? Basketball. For real? Basketball? Yeah. I thought y'all said football. Hey, this is Cameron. I'm here with Mr. Rainey. Mr. Rainey, how you feeling about this basketball game coming up? Feeling pretty good, man. We've been training all year. Uh, got to get a little revenge from last year. Kind of felt like we got cheated out of a win. So, looking forward to it. What kind of matchups are you looking forward to? Oh man, that's a great question. Thanks, Cameron. Uh, I'm, you know, I'm really looking forward to seeing Mr. Montford. Mr. Montford, if you're looking at this, I want you to listen very carefully. I'm gonna stomp a mud pond in you if you come down that lane. Do you understand me? Sorry, it's a little personal. Back to you. I'm Linda Richardson, and this is Coach Pierce, and I just want to ask him a few questions. How do you feel about the big basketball game? Land, I'm gonna tell you, man. I feel I feel really, really confident about this big basketball game that we got coming up. The Wolfpack, my team, been having some really, really solid practices lately. We got a tough opponent coming in, the Savages. And I know it's gonna be a tough test, but as always, the Wolfpack's always gonna come out on top. Okay, and I see we are in the weight room. Have you been working out? Landon, the weight room, son. If you know me, you know I've been working out. You know I've been working out, Landon. This is my home away from home in here. And I'm going to tell you something, I've been looking down the roster at that other team, the Savages. And I'm looking down these names, and I'm taking them these names one by one, and it seems like none of them have probably ever even stepped foot in a weight room. One in particular by the name of Coach Henson. You know and I know Coach Henson had been in a weight room. He hadn't been in here sweating and grinding it out every day like I have, right? Yes. You want me to tell you why? Because I'm the man of the hour, the man with the power, too sweet to be sour. Sky's the limit, space is the place. Cream of the crop gonna rise to the top. I'm the kind of man that you can't stop. You know that, Landon? Yes. Woo! Can you dig it?